the number one best tip for ranking. And we're getting started right now. What's going on guys? This is Riggs and welcome back to another PUBG Mobile video. Really appreciate you taking a little bit of time out of your day to hang out with me and watch this video. Of course, drop a like if you want to see more ranking videos here on the channel. It's something I absolutely love covering. And what better time than now considering it is a brand new season. So how do you not only start off this season in the best way possible, but all the seasons to come when it comes to ranking and for sure, the biggest thing that people overlook. So I'm gonna give you guys an example here. Using what? Using my stats, okay? Ranking is all about time. It's time investment. Uh, because at the end of the day, that's what it's all about. How much time you put in and what you go ahead and get out. So we're gonna go ahead and look at the stats, okay? I am ranking duos this season. And uh, enough of you guys agree that you wanted to see kind of like a weekly update. Um, how the ranking progression is going and kind of go over the stats and all that. So 30 matches played, okay? 11 wins, top 10, 23. That's not bad, 76%. If I could be picky, I want to get that top 10 to at least 80% and bump up the win ratio possibly to 40%. That would be amazing. KD 4.43, but as a whole, the season's been going very, very well. Not the greatest stats in the world, definitely not the worst. However, I've already played 30 matches with an average survival time of 16 minutes. And if you look at my tier, where am I at right now, fam? I am in Platinum 3. I've played 30 matches already with a, wit with a top 10 ratio of almost 80%. Um, almost a 40% win ratio, yet I'm platinum three. Why is that? That is because I started off the season way down in gold three. So I've managed to pick up 500 points in 30 matches. This is what I'm always talking about when it comes to the tier resets. What you guys need to do and what, what you need to do each and every season starting with this one is to make sure you rank up as high as you possibly can because of that little thing called tier reset that happens at the beginning of each new season. Because I didn't really push in duos in Cycle 1 Season 1, I was ranking in solos, which I did make it to ace, uh, or I wasn't ranking in duos, I would start off in gold. That is crazy considering if I get, let's say I make it to ace in duos, when the season resets, that would put me at Platinum 2. Platinum 2. Platinum 2 is 100 points further than I am now, yet I've already put in 30 matches. It's all about preparation in order to make it the easiest possible way for you to rank. You put in the time and you need to prepare for the future when it comes to rank. So again, just to drive it home, 30 matches, yet I'm only Platinum 3. But if I had ranked in the previous season and say I made it to ace and I continued to push um, you know, in duos uh, you know, going on to this season as well, I'd be 100 points further than I am now playing that many matches, zero. Because if you look, um, if we go ahead and look here, look, it looks, if you, someone looked at my profile, they think, wow, Riggs is really dead. He doesn't even, he doesn't even play the game anymore. Zero wins, zero top 10. But that's because that's my solo stats. And not playing any solo matches, I'm, our, I'm still ahead after putting in 30 over in duos. So the number one thing that you can do playing this game is to make sure that you manage your time efficiently. There's not many people out there, at least that I know, who have unlimited time. We get busy with work, we get busy with school, with family, with friends. Um, I mean, it's just, it's crazy how long it truly takes to rank. Even if you have kind of decent stats, it can still take a very long time and it can be very daunting. Um, but making sure you prep now, it, uh, to, to give you to put you in the best position possible for next season especially for those of you that really want to crush it and make it even as far as conquer whether you and that's it could be ace Dom, uh, dominator ace master whether you hit conquer or many of you watching this might be hitting ace for the first time um 
that's the number one best tip is to make sure you're doing the preparation the season before. So that way, when you start off the season, it's, it doesn't sting as much. You don't have to put in as much time, but you can get even further um, in the ranking. A lot of you guys also in the last video have been requesting more gameplay. So that's why I'm going to go ahead and leave this video. If you guys learned something, or again, if you want to see more ranking tips and tricks here on the channel, let me know by, of course, dropping a like. I can't wait to read your guys' comments. But I will leave you guys with some of um, our gameplay from me and Chief Lord Black. It has been so much fun. I've never had more fun playing this game than right now. Um, and it's amazing. And I'm glad you guys are here for the journey. But until the very next one, this has been Riggs from Riggs Gaming. I'm the hill to the beat. Watch here. out! I'm doing time. Um, oh, yeah, you're fresh. I don't want to Other two is back there. Take care of these guys first. They might be able to drop. Enemies ahead! Watch out! This. Friends going from. Can chuck a whole bunch of nades up there. I might try to peek though. Watch that little toss.